right, Fred Manheck is in the News 9 Kitchen today, and uh, he's from a new restaurant in Manchester, Celebrations Kitchen. And I know you started out as uh, doing catering. You still do catering. Yeah, we still do catering. We started out in Nashville. We've been, we're, we're there for 20 years, and then we moved up here. And we've been doing catering since March, and we just opened the restaurant uh, in November. That's great. Now, you yeah. brought in a bunch of your salads and also some of your sandwiches, and you're going to make us this pretty cool Reuben quesadilla. You were talking to us about the meat that you're using That's right. Reuben. Well, I like pastrami myself, mm -hmm. so it is a pastrami Reuben, technically, and uh, we actually cure our own meats. We cure the corned beef, and we smoke the pastrami. Same thing with our ham. We cook our turkey. It's not like turkey loaf or anything like that. But you can get a turkey dinner there as but well. You, yeah, turkey dinner, roast beef dinner, uh, corned beef dinner. But sure. This is perfect for you know game day tomorrow. A lot of people are going to be probably hosting parties as they watch right. the Patriots, and this is a new way to cook a Reuben. Yeah, so absolutely. What are you doing and here? I wanted something quick and easy, yeah. so uh, I've got one in the frying pan right now. I'll show you quickly how it, how it's made, and it's not difficult at all. I mean, I already put the Swiss cheese on there. Mm -hmm. And so now I'm just putting putting the meat down. And what do you have mixed in with the meat here? Well, it's it's kind of like a Reuben combination. It's got it's the pastrami, it's the sauerkraut, it's the Thousand Island dressing. And so you just put it in like this. All mixed together. All mixed together. You know, like if you're doing this for game day tomorrow, and you don't want to miss uh, Edelman catching you know catching Brady's <laughs> pass, what I would do is I would heat this up a little bit because it'll go quicker. Mm -hmm. And you just want to put the the Swiss cheese on it. And you know you don't have to do a Reuben. I mean, the, the quesadillas are a real easy thing to do. I mean, you can do like a turkey provolone or you know an Italian. I mean, anything. It doesn't just have to be like a you know a Mexican chicken quesadilla. You can get creative with it. What's really nice is that the Reuben is really easy to do. Mm -hmm. And then pretty much that's all you need to do is and just just it. that. And then you can you know some people sometimes right. people don't want the whole sandwich, so they can just exactly. kind of cut off what they want. So I like to use real butter. Mm -hmm. Just gives a little better flavor. As I said, I had this cooking for a little while, so I'm just going to take it. I'm going to flip it. And there you go. I'm just going to flip that, put it in. You let it. You let it toast. And then just kind of cut it up. Once and it then comes you just out. cut it up. Sure. So um, tell people about uh, the hours that you have at the restaurant. Well, we just opened for breakfast, mm -hmm. and we're open at um, uh, six on the weekdays, and um, seven o'clock on the weekends. And our, our hours are basically six uh, six to eight o'clock. And even though you still have the restaurant, uh, you are doing the catering as well. So that's right. And hopefully the Patriots will have more games to play. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely hoping that right. for, for, right. for other reasons. <laughs> well, Fred, thanks so much for coming oh, in. This sure. is a great idea. We appreciate it. All right. All right. Do I have and enough time to yeah, cut we're that up? Cut that up, All and right. uh, we'll be right cool. back. I'll put that right down. <laughs>